Those bodyguards were tougher than the, everybody else. Spit it out. Right, what's this then? See if we can get ourselves into some semblance of order. Now, now knowing that we're going to be in a fight, we can cast our protections. <laughs> okay, let's you just right. think about this logically here. What on earth? They're going to be silenced. The wizards can be silenced. I'm not too bothered about those. Um, it's definitely a call for more potent arrows, so plus one arrows at the very least, plus one bullets, uh, and plus one bullets, okay, potion of magic blocking, they're going to be silent so it's not a massive issue, although we might just pop potions of defense, which will make us, should reduce our Let's have a look if it does reduce. Might be a waste, might be a total waste. No, it does reduce his armor class. So popping potions of defense for the fighters. Thy temper shield. Reduce fear or resist fear. Just in case I get a spell or two off. Bless. Come on. There we go. Chant. If Tempus wills it. Giving um, Kagan aid, because he's the one with the least hit points. In, well, he's got less, I suppose, but. Giving him a boost. Right, so we're all buffed up, I think. <laughs> You're a queer fellow. Uh huh. Go on then. Okay, so uh, what we'll do is we'll save over the auto save. I don't want to talk speed. But no more alls of speed, unfortunately. You right, sorted. Thank mistress, someone has come for me at last. A joy is me, and I am a joy. It's true. Is that so? Don't tell me we- Of course, not for nothing. You have just experienced the honor of meeting Buck, well, not intentionally. It's all- He's not just- The real trouble began when Rogdor- <laughs> At last. Not only- Half a- Half. You will- Yeah. And I didn't even then put not if I can help it. <laughs> right, okay, so we're off and running. Right, let's see if we can get this sorted this time. So straight away, casting silence. That's the first thing. What Nira is, it this time? is going to straight away Nira. use a wand of monster summoning here to provide extra assistance. Um This is so tough. So This is a really tough fight. Um, yeah, okay, so Wand of Monster Summoning to summon some extra help. Silence. Get the fighters. On the Ogre Berserker to start with. He can poison his weapon, actually, if you haven't done. I'll have him go into Dwarven Defender mode. Take down the toughest ones first. These two, whilst they're silenced, are weak as hell. So we'll ignore them. Take down the, the tougher ones first. So Ogre Berserker first, then the two bodyguards, then we'll deal with them last. So Immuwen firing on the Ogre Berserker. And I think she's going to utilize his arrows plus two here. We want to get him down as quickly as we can. <clears throat> right. You right. Moving in. I need an L. Moving in. I will listen. Moving in. Yep. Firing. She's casting silence and she's using her wand of monster summoning. Right, the monster summon the, the summons are off to do their stuff. 
There we go, we got them summoned. Good. Uh -huh. So what can she do now? She's going to pull back a little bit, don't want to get too close. Um, charm, let's see if we can charm one of these bodyguards here. That might make life a little bit easier. Where are they going now? They're off again already, going after the weakest party members. What is it this time? I'll do it. Branwen has been stabbed. <laughs> I think the ogre's down. Is the ogre dead? One arrows. Sip your potion, lovey. Is she, is she, is she, she's an, um. If Ooh! Badly injured, near her. Uh -huh. Getting My into a corner see. here. Somebody help her. What is it this time? My turn to save the day. Both of you, get out of there. I think we might be okay here. Hello. Eat move. I've done had enough of this. By Tempus Shield. If Tempus wills it. Move it! Fine, you want to fight? We'll fight. Yep. Give us victory. You rang? I cannot this way. Right. Finally, those two pains are dead. Right, kill this idiot quick before silence runs out. Silence has run out! What's he cast on us? Oh god! Go on then. Sort it. Uh-huh. Luckily those gnolls are certainly providing A good what distraction. Wild Surge, what was that? Don't know what it was, but uh, didn't seem to do anything too bad. Oh, I think we've done it. Inconvenient mix-up. Inconvenient? You just disappeared on us and didn't even help. Yes, certainly. Oh, I would have preferred to fight beside you. Alas, as a practitioner of wild magic, I can always predict the outcome of my spells. Yeah, whatever, pal. The red wizards pursue your friend Nira and me to study us, or perhaps just our brains, to learn why we can wield the power of arcane chaos, and they can't. Can we not talk about having our brains studied, please? Pretty, please? 
Of course, my dear. Uh, now, as I was saying before we were so rudely interrupted, I... Wait, where was I? Yes, you were talking about the goblins. You were worshipped as a god, captured by a hot goblin. Ah, yes, of course. Well, that about sums it up. The next thing I know, you've slain Rock Doc and freed me from captivity. Come on, old man. Make with the wisdom. No one gets to be your age without learning a few things. You must know how to avoid the crazy surges of power. You're holding out on me. Not at all, my dear. The only secret is to accept the bad with the good. You don't complain when your fireball incinerates an entire tribe of trolls, do you? You just have to be ready to improvise when it showers them in flower petals instead. Half the fun of our profession is that you never know what will happen next. But I'd have never discovered the joy of being a woman if that spell hadn't turned on me last summer. <laughs> Nera can identify with that. That can't be all there is. You'd never have survived to be so very, very old without something up your sleeve. Since you put it that way, maybe there is one thing I can give you. It isn't up my sleeve, but around my waist. I constructed this belt for my occasional trips into town. Accidentally shocking those who shake my hand can be chopped up to carelessness. But a giant spider with the voice of an old man running through town? <laughs> Forget about it. I seldom visit settlements these days, so perhaps you'll get more use out of it than I do. And maybe a little peace of mind. <laughs> yeah. Uh, a belt. Godan, uh, not quite so pleased with that, considering what we've just endured. Is that the best you can do, he's saying? Oh, don't think I've forgotten you. Watch as I conjure my fabulous treasure trove, all for you. Uh, no, Godan's suddenly uh, <laughs> changing tact here. No, 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 if you have to summon it, don't. Don't worry yourself. No, it's not fair. I've traveled so far and overcome so many obstacles all on my own, and he just disappears. Uh, <clears throat> yes, good on clearing his throat. Uh, all on your own, you say? Oh, of course you helped. I haven't forgotten that it's all about you. Oh, excuse me, Miss Moody Pants. Are you a god? Apparently, what the hell's that all about? The Wild Mage, a die was captured by the very goblins he accidentally summoned. The worship team, blah de blah de blah. But we put an end to Ekendar. Okay, thank you, Knowles. Right, you have been a great help. Wand of Monster Summoning proving its worth Stay there. Now. Certainly giving us a leg up on the second right, attempt. Head? Here he is. Well, that wasn't the loot I was expecting, to be fair. I was expecting something more lucrative. But anyway, we have a belt given to us by a doy, which will probably be most beneficial to Nera. Uh, robe, which looks like we already have. Could be something similar to this one. Actually, it looks slightly different, to be fair. This is increases intelligence. Potion of genius. Mind focus. I thought it was the... Po oh, okay. Maybe I was wrong about this whole situation with learning spells. Anyway, we'll get to that very soon. Um, I think that's it. I think that might be that.
you rang. We'll make our way back to the ranger, see if we can tell him that we found the body of Rilsa. Maybe he can give us some kind of reward, although I'd highly doubt it. And then from here, we'll make our way back to Nashville, where we can sell what we need to sell, rest up, and refocus and replan for what we're going to do next. Gather your party before venturing forth. Because it's been a long travel, I tell you. Venturing forth. Go on, then. A long trip. I'm on it. It's better to die on your feet than live on your knees. Vita, more, more. Go on, then. Sorted. Speaking with Magreb. Don't mess with nature. Or it'll mess with you. What have you discovered? Have you avenged my Rilsa? <laughs> yes, yes. We've slain the last of the goblins. Rilsa is avenged. We didn't do it for that particular reason, but that is what's happened. I suppose that's for the best. Even though I know Rilsa would have preferred a peaceful solution. Thank you. Did you find where those goblins murdered my Rilsa? What? Apparently... Well, what's this? Oh, I don't know. We did find it. We, we found her body. But we can't seem to mention that. Spit it out. Don't mess with nature, or it'll mess with you. Um, strange. We could head back in there and see if uh, we can do anything extra, but Godan really doesn't care, you rang. to be quite frank with you. I'm on it. And he doesn't look like he's in the best position to give us any lucrative items. So, uh, swiftly moving on back to Nashkel. Peace. Sanctuary. Sort of. ah, it's good to be back in a place where we're not going to be ambushed by goblins, by wizards, by bloody berserker ogres, by undead. <laughs> Seems to be a long, long journey we've been on this past few days. But our journey is not yet over. Right, what's this then? Dealing with criminals. Chains a man's soul. <laughs> so I don't want to turn in a reward here about Prism. Because we found Prism and, and obviously uh, stole the gems and sold them. And it seems that we might have been found out. Payment denied. <laughs> oh dear. Oh, maybe it was the whole Greybeard situation that's now come to fruition. Oh dear. He's found out about the fact that we're not Greybeard. Oh well. Never mind. Spit it out. <laughs> it was fun while it lasted. It. Oh dear. Who cares? Because very shortly we'll have our own little bounty when we sell all of these items at the Nashkel store. I'm on it. Yeah, business has been poor, but with the iron shortage and all. So, what can we sell? Chain plus one, heart of the golem, darts of wounding, short bow. It's 2,000. Takes us to 11,000 gold pieces. Studded leather armor plus one as well. Lovely. 
And a mangy old skull. <laughs> Uh, he's got nothing, he's got nothing, she nothing there. She's got some gems and stuff, and some scrolls. And she's got some stuff to identify, which we'll do tomorrow. Okay. You were right, customer is always right. always right. Customer is always right. Especially when the customer is go down, of course. So we can sell chromatic orb. The rest of them will keep. And the gem bag. Pearl necklace, 500 gold. Lovely. Thirteen thousand gold. And you further ready? items potentially to sell as well. Go on then. I think tonight calls for some major celebrations in the inn. Sorted. And you know what? We ain't even started yet. Because down south, there are some areas where no doubt there will be some winter wool pelts at 500 gold pieces a pop. So tonight we shall celebrate. Tonight we shall drink, eat, be merry. Look back on the battles we've had and laugh because we're still alive. And then tomorrow we'll head out. Skin some wolves. Make some more coin. And go down. We'll be ecstatic about it. See you soon.